Hi guys, just coming on. I'm gonna share a project for for B Park. Um, I've done some of their little clay pieces. All I've done is painted them so far with just one base coat. Um, I'm gonna actually do something else with them as I go along. Um, I've got out some paper texture paste. Um, I've got out some art stones maybe. It depends, all I've got to do is get a stencil. Got cut two of the large Tim Holtz tags. Most of, the, most of you have probably got these dies, but I do love them and they're always a go-to. I'm gonna try and do a couple of Sea Life tags using the little clay pieces that I've done. And um, yeah, we'll start on that. So I better go and find a, a couple of stencils and I'll be back to do this. So I'm back again, guys. I've got a couple of stencils that I can use. So I'm gonna do this then, get this done, and then I can dry it. this away I'll go and wash my stencils and my silicone brush and wash my hands <laughs> and uh, we'll get these dry and I'll be back two tags done and I wanted I wanted them to look a bit messy if you know what I mean or like this one would have cut off here on a line but I took it up and splattered it out more because I want that effect on it you know um so yeah these are dry now and these are using the paper texture paste which is a nice actually nice feel to it actually it's soft um and we'll see what we can do i'll be back in a minute right i've just got some old lace out of my lace pile i'm thinking about putting some lace on it so i'm gonna stick that down
which I'm, that's what I'm going to use. I'm going to put a little bit of glue down. dried them off a bit I'm hoping they'd be dry enough to paint over I've got some teal paint I'm gonna start off with painting with that
like a mess at the moment, but believe me, it'll come together. Right, um, do this and I'll be back when this is all dry. Okay, I'm back with these again, guys. Um, I'm just trying to sort out which turtle I like best. Because these are only air drying clay, but I've painted a few of them. But some of them have got like, some of their legs have turned a bit weird. I think I might as well stick with that one. Um, right, what I've done up to now is I've added, um, I've used my Lindsay sprays and uh, my misters coloured. And I've gone over the backgrounds, round the lace, round these little balls. And then after I dried that, I've used some of my pastes. I've used the bronze and I've used the sapphire, which are these, oh, which are these two colors. Um, it's giving it like a patinaed look. Now I've got my little clay pieces that I managed to make out of the molds. Um, and I'm just laying down where I think um, they should go. That I've done these all different colours. Um, I'm not sure if I can get that one in. No, it won't fit in there, will it? Mind you, I mean, um, would that look better on there? No, it's exactly the same as that one. Okay, right. So, right, so as I said, I've dried my sprays off. I've just, I haven't glued anything yet. I've just put placements down because I want to put some gilding waxes on these um, little pieces. And these little pieces, all I've done is I've gone round them with some um, acrylic paint, but they still need some sort of, you know, more texture on them, if you know what I mean. They need some more, they need a bit of wax on them or a bit of spray or something on them. The trouble is with air drying clay that, that's this light, if it gets too wet, it goes mushy. So you have to be so careful. And you have to be careful when you're drying with a heat gun if you've got the pieces laid down as well. But I'm going. what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn this sheet around. I've still got ball, little tiny balls dropping off everywhere. I've got balls and balls and balls all over my table. <laughs> um, but I'm going to go now and I'm going to glue these parts on um, and then decorate them up. And then we should be near enough done. I've got to cut um, another backing out for the tags to place them on because you see, they're like this. You see what I mean? You don't want that, that's too thin. So if you um, stick them onto another piece of card, they'll lay flat and they'll be more sturdy. Um, and they'll be a nice tag. So we've got to sort this out. I'm gonna go and do that and I'll be back in a little while. Um, let me show you, I'm outside at the moment. <laughs> 